Hello YouTube, here with another pipe video. <clears throat> and in today's video I'm going to give my simple review of Capstan Original Navy Cut, the blue tin. So, I'm smoking Capstan Original Navy Cut in my Hardcastle Camden. Baby little thing. Fantastic smoker. It was another estate. No, it wasn't. It was a antique store find. Got that little acrylic. Alright, it's not acrylic. It's a little vinyl bit on here. Alright. Capstan Original Navy Cut. Uh, quick recap before I begin. My rating system is on a scale of 1 to 10. And, uh, yeah, well, that's it. The original, the gold navy cut, scored a 5.44 for reference, if you care at all for that. Now, the original navy cut, for those of you who don't like watching the entire video, is scored a 6.33. So, much better. All right. Capstan Original Navy Cut. <clears throat> it's brand is Capstan. It's blended by McBaron. Manufactured by McBaron. It is a straight Virginia blend. It only contains Virginia. Uh, has no flavoring, or it says other. I don't know what the hell that means, so I'm going to go with none. I don't detect any. So. Uh, it's cut is a flake, though I rubbed mine out because it dries it out a little bit better and it's easier to uh, pack in some of my smaller pipes that I keep for Virginias. Packaging, 50 gram tin. Well, this. Need to be the little thing, right? Small tin. It is currently available. You can get it from your local brick and mortar, which if you're just sampling it, is where you should pick it up. Or from smoking pipes for eleven ninety. Okay, so rubbed out the flake looks like looks like uh, terrible lighting. You don't need to see it. They have better pictures elsewhere. On to the numbers. Nicotine strength of this blend I gave a five. Uh, which is decent. It doesn't have enough for me to feel anything but I know it's there because I'm not crazy because I'm not craving my gum so I give it a five flavor strength now this is where I think it really really stands apart from its uh, sister blend the golden navy cut it is much more flavorful it, it has a lot more flavor than the uh, the gold while it's still not as bold as something like Dunhill flake <clears throat> It's pretty good. So flavor strength, I gave a six. It tastes like, when smoking, like straw, grass, hay, that sort of thing. And a little bit, I don't know if you guys have ever tried molasses, but it kind of reminds me, it has a sweetness of, of molasses. So that's that. Uh, room note, my, well, I gave it a seven. It, it smells pretty good walking in here. It doesn't have that cigarette-y, German, uh, German cigarette-y smell. Best time of day to smoke, and this is based sure, uh, pre purely off of the, uh, the mild flavor and the, the decent nicotine, uh, is late evening. I think it's good late evening smoke. Very relaxing, mellow. Uh, wife approval rating. This got a six. She, she rated it as a six. She didn't like it as much as some of the other blends, but she liked it a lot more than others. Packability, I gave as an 8. I rubbed mine out, which is fairly fairly easy. And it loads right in here. So, uh, the stuff and uh, fold and stuff method is the same. It's, it's pretty easy and it smokes well. Uh, lightability, well, rubbed out 
it, it lights like a charm. Um, fold it over at a little bit harder, uh, harder time, but you know, still not bad. Ease of keeping lit. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good, especially for Virginia. It's not going out very often, and um, pretty easy to keep lit. Tongue bite. Uh, remember, higher is better. It got a five. If you chief on this fucker, then it'll burn you. But if you sip it, as some people say, then uh, it'll treat you well. Relinability. This is an important one to me. You know the because my wife always comes home in the middle of a bowl and wants to do things, and I have to come back to it a while later. And how does it taste upon relight? You know. I gave it a five. It uh, it's not the best, it's not the worst, it's okay. So I got a five on relightability. So puts its overall rating at six point three three, a little lower than I would have preferred it, but um, it is what it is. So. That is, Cap, that is my simple opinion of Capstan Original Navy Cut. I hope you all enjoyed it. And if you'd like me doing reviews, please give me the thumbs up. <clears throat> and if you don't like them, or think that I should change the way I do them, don't give me a thumbs down. Just, just, just let me know in the comments below, and you probably have a great idea. And I'd love to know about it. So, uh, here is the spreadsheet before I go. If you can see it. Alright. I'll talk to you guys later.